morning, children. I am Lam G, a grade 4 mathematics teacher at Baldenville Elementary School. Today, I will share a fraction story that will enhance your comprehension and mathematical skills. But before continuing on my story, let us study first the following words to be used in the story later. Upside means the land and scenery of a rural area. Now we're going to use the word countryside in a sentence. Example, they explore the surrounding countryside. Number two, distribute. Meaning to divide something among several or many people. We will use the word distribute in a sentence. Example, information leaflets are being distributed to the hotels and guest houses. Number three, pictorially means in the form of picture or a photograph. Example, the author translated only the lessons while the description of the animals were presented pictorially. So without further ado, may I begin my story about Ravindra, who is strolling and found three brothers puzzled with a strange wheel in a form of rhythm. He understood that he had to apply math concept in the puzzle. Could he solve the mystery behind the wheel? This story is about fraction. Once there was a wise man, Ravinda. One day, while he was taking stroll on his horse in the countryside, he found three boys very sad and crying. He consoled them and asked as of why they were crying. One of them said, We, Nandan, Chandan, and Kondan are brothers. Our father passed away some days ago. He left 17 horses for us. His last wish was to divide the horses in the following fashion. Nandan should take one half of all horses Shandan should take one third of all horses. Kondan should take one man of all horses. He also asked not to kill any horse. Now we do not know how to distribute the horses without killing anyone, said Gloomy Nandan, the eldest one. Shandan spoke then. We are sad that we are not able to fulfill his last wish. Ravendra thought for a while before he spoke. It should not be a problem. I will give you my words and it should solve the problem. He started drawing circles on the ground and then continued. We will try to share it pictorially. Let's represent the horses with circles. Ravindra draw 18 circles. Here are your 17 circles and mine is the 18th. Now Nanda should take 9 circles as he gets one half of the total horses, according to the wheel. Ravindra said and check nine circuits. He checked six circuits again and said, Chundan should get one third of all horses, hence, these are his chair. At last, he gave two circuits to Kondan saying, These are one night of 18 horses which goes to Kondan. Now, the total of your share is 9 plus 6 plus 2 equals 17 horses. We are left with one circle which is my horse, continued Ravenna. As this is so and the horses are divided, I am taking my horse, continued Ravenna and rode away on his horse, binding them goodbye. Did you enjoy the story I've shared with you? Great! I am happy that you enjoy and learn something from the fraction story you've listened earlier. So I have a questions for you to think about. 
Can you find out why did Ravendra's advice work? So please, write your answer on the chat box so that I may be able to read your answer. Excellent answer, kids. Ravindra's advice worked because they were able to divide the inheritance of the three brothers as what had been asked by their father before he died. This is what Ravindra did. He analyzed and the problem by using the pictograph, wherein he draw 18 circles which represent the 18 horses. Half of the 18 circles are 9, which was given to Nandan. Another way to answer it is to divide 18 by 2 with the same answer as 9. One third of the 18 circle is 6, which is given to Chandan. Another way to answer it is to divide 18 by 3 with the same answer as 6. One ninth of the 18 circles is 2, which was given to Kandan. Well, another way to answer it is to divide 18 by 9. Therefore, we have the same answer which is 2. Happy learning! Bye-bye!